Greetings, brothers and sisters of Ukraine. I am Magnus Jurt of Charlottendal, Jarna, Sweden. I send you this video recording on request of my friend. This is instead of being with you in person, a poor supplement, I am sure. <laughs> I do wish to meet you. I wish to work together, share food and sing. Alas, this summer I am dedicating to my family and my projects here, right where I am. Um, I will, however, <coughs> show you a little bit of how I live, what I've been doing over the past year on this place, and um, yeah, just speak freely, really. <laughs> I haven't planned this very much. I'm leaving uh, tonight to reunite with my family, brothers and sisters. So, this is the Charlottendal Eco Village in uh, near Jarna. Uh, I came here one year ago, and since then I've been working full time to set up my own encampment outside the farm. I'll show you briefly where where my base is. Okay, hang on. <laughs> here is the uh, uh, the farm and the anthroposophic uh, Waldorf school uh, preschool. Um, some houses that is partly energized by solar power and uh, earth heating and so forth so it's a pretty progressive place as far as this region is concerned um, most importantly it's a wonderful place <laughs> um, I will and here let's move on um, this is where I go for to fetch my water I don't have running water where I am so I go here twice weekly maybe and uh, put water on my little water wagon over there. Here be chickens. They're quite late. Cute as ever. Hello. Hello. <laughs> and here's my water water wagon. It'll last me for a while. So I bring you to my place. <laughs> um, <laughs> say, well, to begin with, it's a wonderful place where I am. Um, and I was quite fortunate to, to end up here. Um, simply invited by the generous host, Peter Hagerut. Here, I'll bring you to my place and I'll show you around, yeah?
this is a Mongolian ger or yurt that I have constructed over the past few years and uh, since winter this year I have lived here beginning with uh, a good friend of mine uh, Peter Talberg mark that name by the way very intelligent fellow um, now since a few months back I live here alone and uh, <laughs> which is quite lovely actually. <laughs> it's uh, not very large, but for my purposes it suits me excellent. It's a four meter diameter building and uh, I'll try to make the very, very best of it. Um, just to create the finest home that I have ever lived in. So here is somewhat what it looks like. Here be my bed. And I've got a wonderful large stove here gives a lot of warmth in winter time and now during summer season I may light one fire in the evening if I feel like being really cozy and uh, here's a guest bed eventually I'll tear that out and make a workspace and open up the floor a bit more uh, here's my toolbox I constructed this over a year's time actually during a course I went to in boat building um, here I'll see if I can give proper shot. So, yeah, here's the insides of my dwelling. Um, so that was a little tour of my place. Um, this way of life is a lot of fun. I'm usually active throughout the days, but I put in plenty of time for rest as well. There's always something interesting to do, collecting firewood for the winter, building on little projects like my compost toilet over here, who is due for a refurbishing. <laughs> Places to gather and tell stories. Processing wood. Don't know how long this will last, but it's a lot more than I had last winter. <laughs> and it's set in a wonderful scenery. some amazing things together um, I'm really what excites me about Ukrainian and the sort of Slavic region is the preservation of traditional crafts um, both women crafts and man crafts if I may say so um, and uh, I see some wonderful things happening um, I'm always looking for the sort of mm, the exciting place to be right now that is precisely where I am I'd like to connect and uh, broaden my horizons into the wider European habitat. Such is my wish and desire. And I send you my blessings, greetings, thanksgivings for all the good work that you do. And uh, hope that we meet in the future. You are, of course, welcome to visit me here, should you like so. I love you and I wish you the very best and a wonderful summer and 